Most people tell us if they're you know, smelling a, an odor above their house, and if it's over a crawl space, that's where it's coming from. Houses have a stack effect, which means the air comes up through the house and out the vents or, or out the roof. So essentially, the musty odors or, or whatever that you're smelling above it is coming from below it. We have what we call the four things you should do to a crawl space. One is to waterproof it, is to make sure that it doesn't have any standing water in it. The second thing that we would do is is stop any outside air infiltration, such as vents. The old myth was to have a cross ventilation in a crawl space. Well, what you're doing is if you have a crawl space that is 50 to 55 degrees year round, and you have a 90 degree air mass on the outside of that crawl space, when those two air masses hit, it causes condensation. And in the end, condensation causes mold. So what we do is we seal that air off. Third, we'll put an encapsulation over the floor and up the walls. Now our encapsulation is called the clean space. It's a 20 mil, seven layers thick, polyethylene liner with a polyester cord. Very, very durable, carries a 25 year rip tear warranty, transferable. The fourth thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna dehumidify the space. We're going to treat the air in that space no different than the air that we treat above the space. So we drop the relative humidity in that crawl space below 50% where dust mites, allergens, and mold can't live. We feel once you spend the money once, you never have to spend it again.